Real Men Sing has been a really <clears throat> exciting project for the men of the Stables Area Men's Course. We spent a lot of time trying to decide what kind of things would be meaningful and uh, leave a lasting impression on our audience and our performers. And for us, Real Men Sing is something we're really passionate about. It's fun to watch guys grow. It's fun to bring them to, uh, to our hometown and our kind of small town Minnesota and uh, to a place that some people have dubbed the city that sings, uh, which is just real cool because one of the things we do here is sing, a lot of people enjoy it, and they do it for their whole lives. One of the things that the Stables Area Men's Course thought that Real Men Sing might do for them was help with recruitment. But we didn't ever really realize uh, exactly how that would happen. The benefit has been, uh, it's been a secondary benefit. We don't necessarily feel like guys who participate in Real Men Sing end up in the chorus but we feel like guys join the chorus and continue to sing in the chorus because we're doing meaningful projects like Real Men Sing. So it allows us to recruit uh, the kind of men that want to be part of uh, changing lives and working hard for their community and uh, making doing things that matter and uh, doing things with other men that are important. So Real Men Sing is something we really uh, enjoy and we feel really lucky uh, and honored that so many schools and students and organizations will support it and help and so many professional musicians and groups have been a part of our Real Men Sing program. We might be giving away a little bit of a trade secret here, but I wish everybody could be a fly on the wall when uh, the Real Men Sing committee, our group of men from the chorus get together who are responsible for most of the logistical pieces. Uh, when that committee meets and they start talking about how great it is uh, when it happens and how wonderful it felt and then instantly they go right straight into how can we make it better? What can we do to better serve our people? And uh, what a great life lesson it is for a younger guy like me who's got little kids to watch these guys who've uh, raised their kids and, and, and paid off their homes and are close to retirement and listen to them speak with passion about things that really matter in the world and uh, I wish everybody could see that. I wish everybody could see how the organization operates and how much it's never about them and how much it's about what can we do to make, make the world a better place. It's the adage that uh, with great gifts come great responsibility and uh, our guys do a great job with that.